Good afternoon, traders. It is Tuesday, November 27th, 2018, and the U.S. stock market is closed. Uh, we had kind of just a blah day today, but uh, the Dow did pretty well, I think, actually. Um, you can see here at the beginning of the day, it, it open much lower and I thought oh okay here we go yesterday's po very positive action was a dead cat bounce and now we're going to go down maybe even take out those lows I've been talking about uh, didn't happen it rallied all day and ended up closing uh, near its high and that's good Dow officially ends up up 102 points. So the Dow had a good day. We didn't have a very great day. We um, we closed out about uh, $1,200 positive in our closeout trades. That's pretty good. But we got into six new positions, three positive, three negative, and we're negative uh, $1,500 on w what we... Uh, are carrying into tomorrow so you know basically break even I'll show you a couple of the stocks I'll show you the one that was the biggest problem for us this is uh, DWT which is inverse crude oil and you can see what happened here middle of the day this thing shot up we bought it as it was going up it got up here with positive a while, and then it faded all day long. And we're down about uh, uh, two and a half thousand dollars on that. So uh, that was not good. This is kind of weird price action. Hard to call that one. Could totally reverse tomorrow. We'll just have to see. And then um, finally, I showed you this yesterday, but we got out of this. This is um, uh, SENS, which is Sensionix Holdings Incorporated, Sensonix Holdings, something like that. Gapped up yesterday. We bought that gap, and it gapped a little again this morning, and we took our profits on that gap, and uh, we took out over six thousand dollars out of uh, Sensonix Holdings so that was just a super trade and that is what kept us out of the red on our exits this morning anyway uh, not a great day but uh, we'll see how things go tomorrow this is Trader Bob signing off I will be back here tomorrow on Wednesday